Hello everybody, welcome back to Mr. P channel. <clears throat> Excuse me. In the previous video I was trying to play Call of Duty on my Chromebook using Parsec um, service, Parsec software, uh, basically streaming Call of Duty from my gaming PC to my Chromebook. In this video let's find out can you actually play Path of Exile in that kind of way where Path of Exile is running on your gaming PC and you're getting the gaming stream, doesn't matter where you are in the world, using a Parsec software. So, um, how to start Parsec, I've already done uh, videos previously, it's very easy, just create an account, then load the server app, install on your gaming PC, then load the client app, install on your Android device or other PC or Android phone or Chromebook of Android enabled. When you've done everything and you connect the both, um, both programs to the same account, when you run a Parsec app for the first time, you should see... Uh, a, link, um, a line saying log in. When you logged in, you should see a, a, your computer appears in the list. This is mine, Mr. P. So when I click on that, I connect into my Windows gaming PC. So let's wait until this connects. So that's it. I'm connected. Uh, if you missed my previous video, I'd like to point out that the Parsec app can be downloaded from Google Play Store. It used to be a side loading um, so solution to Android devices, but about a couple of days ago or nearly a week ago, it all depends when this video will go live. They announced that Parsec app can be downloaded from Google Play Store. It's unstable at the moment and released. It's a bit buggy, but still it's usable. And if you want to just try it out, it's no problem. It's free to use. So uh, Path of Exile. Let's double click on the Path of Exile and wait until it's loading. So... Um, Connecting to my Steam account and opening the Path of Exile. So let's have a look. This uh, Path of Exile, if you don't know, this is like an MMORPG. It's, it's quite um, heavy, intense, and it's, I, I love this game. And first thing, what I noticed, even if the game is running on my gaming PC, which is there, as you can see, it's a loading screen now. The actual Parsec app crashed. Well, disconnected, so I need to go click back. Actually, what I need to do is pin it to a start. It's always here, so I'm going to have to click every time I want to open it. So I can see on a gaming PC, it's already running in the main menu, but the actual Parsec Android app is still thinking, does it need to connect? So refresh, click, and connect again. Imagine you're in a calf and you need to do this nearly every time. So is it, I'm in. Uh, streaming quality of this main menu is brilliant. Another thing what I noticed, the mouse is actually works exactly as supposed to. Exactly as supposed to, instead of like on Call of Duty, if you watched that video where I was trying to play Call of Duty being streamed to my Chromebook, mouse wasn't acting that perfectly. I don't know why this game is so special, but anyway, let's try. So it's loading now. And what I can see, I, I will try to show it to you. What I mean by mouse acting perfectly is, as you can see there, there is a mouse at the top, is a gaming PC screen, and this is a Chromebook. As you can see, mouse moves exactly as it moves on the top. So no lag, no jumps, no, no like super fast acceleration of the mouse. Everything is brilliant. So let's try. Okay, uh, first first uh, impression. It's amazing. <laughs> Surprisingly, it's very good. Um, I need to have a look how the delay is, but it's actually very good. I'm I'm surprised that it's actually that good. I'm seriously I'm surprised. I expected that to be well. Possibly right now it's going to crash a million times, it's going to be buggy, it won't going to play, it won't going to load. But so far, let's check things. Why is it so special? Full screen, 1080p as it was on a Call of Duty video. So why? I don't know. Let's try. Let's see if I can use spells. I can Right. Apparently, here we are. Let's raise my zombies. Okay, um, 
yes, it's the, it is playable. I'm, I'm seriously, I am surprised that this, the quality between what I see here and what I see on a gaming screen behind the Chromebook, the quality is not that great. Well, the, I can see the difference between what I'm getting on my gaming PC and what I'm seeing in here. But when you think this is the game that's running somewhere, even even shortcut key is working. So even like I mean keyboard key is working. So um, zoom in, zoom in. Yeah, zoom in is mouse uh, scroll wheel is working too. It's like I feel it's like I'm connected to my gaming PC, and you can sit somewhere in the calf. In a Starbucks or anything or other cafe are available. You just sit in there and just play the game. Seriously, this is brilliant. I'm very surprised about it. Let's raise a couple of new zombies. I'm level whatever it is. I'm level 4 and I'm always playing this area. I'm just... Download this game, installed it, and since then I'm just using as a test. Because it's, it's a, basically should be a same similarity if you want to play, let's say, Diablo 3. It should work with Diablo 3. I possibly will do a video in the future testing Diablo 3 and how to play it on, uh, on, on, on Chromebook or stream on a Chromebook. Bingo, ding. So, yeah, um... It's working perfectly, and I'm, I'm very surprised. And I just click exit, and I'm back to main menu. Obviously, that's again a bit buggy. As you can see, my computer, gaming computer, is already in the Windows, like a desktop, and my gaming or my Chromebook is still at the par second, saying nothing. So close that, back, back, open up, connect again. That's possibly will be changed. I hope they will change that. I will hope they will fix that in the future. But come on, parsec. You're doing a very good job here. I'm very surprised that you can play Path of Exile or I was able to stream Path of Exile in this way. Seriously, good job, guys. Good job. And <clears throat> before I go, um, just a quick uh, mention. No one is paying for this video. And Parsec's not paying for this video. No one's paying for this video. I is not paying for this video. I'm just doing this video. Or I'm doing these videos that to show you guys. How you can enjoy gaming and the productivity and do more productivity work on various devices. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to click subscribe. I'll see you in the near future with another awesome, fantastic video. Thank you and bye-bye.